x square minus y square is equal to 27, xy is equal to 18. What is the value of x plus y? Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we want to find the value of x plus y from this given nice Olympiad exponential equation. We have the given equation x square minus y square is equal to 27. Let's call this equation 1. Then we have s y is equal to 18. Let's call this equation 2. From equation 2, let's make y the subject of the formula. That is, s y is equal to 18. Now let's divide both sides by x. Divide this by x. Divide this by x. This s will cancel this y is equal to 18 divided by s. Let's call this equation 3. Now substitute for equation 3 in equation 1. That is anywhere you see y, you put 18 divided by x there. So equation 1 is s square minus y square is equal to 27 now but y is equal to 18 divided by s we have s square minus 18 divided by s square is equal to 27 and this is s square minus 18 square divided by s square is equal to 27 now let's multiply all through by s square. So we have s square multiplied by s square minus 18 square multiplied by s square divided by s square is equal to 27 multiplied by s square. Now this s square we cancel this s square. We have s square square minus 18 square minus 27 s square is equal to 0. Then we have s square square minus 18 square is still 24 minus 27 s square is equal to 0 and let's s square is equal to m Now we have m square minus 324 minus 27 m is equal to 0. Let's rearrange this. Then we have m square minus 27 m minus 324 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation which can be solved using either factorization method or quadratic general formula. But in this case, I'm going to make use of factorization method. We look for two numbers so that the product will give minus 324 and the sum will give minus 27. Now, let's see. Minus 324 is equal to minus 36 multiplied by 9. Then this is 324. Also, minus 27 is equal to minus 36 plus 9. Therefore, we have m square minus 36 m plus 9 m minus 324 is equal to 0. Then, m square here and m here, we have m into m minus 36 
plus 9 into m minus 36 is equal to 0. We have m here and this is plus 9 here. m minus 36 here and m minus 36 here. m minus 36 multiplied by m plus 9 is equal to 0. There are two cases here. Then m minus 36 is equal to 0 or m plus 9 is equal to 0. Now from here, m is equal to 36. Let's call this m1. Or from here, m is equal to minus 9. Let's call this m2. But L square is equal to M. Therefore, L square is equal to 36 or L square is equal to minus 9. But L square cannot be equal to minus 9. Then this is positive and this is negative. Then this is rejected. Uh, the only true solution we have is s square is equal to 36. Let's work with that. We have s square is equal to 36. Then let's take the square root of both sides. That is square root of what? s square is equal to plus or minus square root of 36. Now this one will cancel this. s is equal to plus or minus 6. Now, we've known the value of x to be equal to plus or minus 6. Let's substitute for x in any of the equation, either equation 1 or 2, to get the value of y. But in this case, I'm going to make use of equation 2. Our equation 2 is giving us sy is equal to 18. This is equation 2. Now, but our x is plus or minus 6. Now, we have plus or minus 6 y is equal to 18. Now, let's divide both sides by plus or minus 6. Then divide by plus or minus 6. Then divide by plus or minus 6. So, this one will cancel this. y is equal to 6 here 1, 6 here 3 plus or minus 3. So that is the value of y. Now, we've gotten the value of s to be equal to plus or minus 6 and y to be equal to what? Plus or minus 3. So the question says we should find the value of x plus y. Therefore, x plus y will be equal to plus or minus 6 plus plus or minus 3. So therefore, S plus Y is equal to plus or minus 9. That is our final answer. If you enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe.